before we start this week's vlog, I want to do a quick demonstration of the difference between Lumar Select Black PPF and your traditional or conventional vinyl Avery 3M, uh, some more whatever difference products out there. We're going to pull out the big guns, the actual barbecue brush that we always use for demonstrations. You can even hear it, eh? Look how bad that is. And then we go over here. So if you have a, like an angry girlfriend and she gets mad at you, or a aluminum bar wielding guy that scrapes the side of your car like we had in Edmonton, this is what's gonna happen. Okay, so let's pull up the good old uh, heat gun. Let's see. A lot of so a lot of vinyl guys are saying, oh, it has some self-healing properties. Let's let's see if, if it works. Still there. And that's pretty much a done deal, you guys. And let's go over here. Done. Let's try again. Can you catch it, John? I think so. Okay, let's see if we can get rid of it. And that's a difference, you guys. Do, so, the, do the bottom right here. Bottom right here? Right here? Yeah. All right, guys, so let's get right into this week's vlog. All right, guys, welcome back to this week's vlog. So we're gonna continue on with changing the look of the FL5. Originally, I wanted to do a gloss carbon fiber paint protection. I thought that was gonna look pretty sick, but unfortunately, it is out of our budget range. Way too expensive for this stuff, you guys. It's roughly about two grand Canadian for 30 feet by 60 inches. Yeah, it's just, it's nice, but too expensive. So we're gonna go with a gloss black uh, roof. Uh, with obviously Lumar Select Black, so it's pretty sick. I already have cut it out. It's on the uh, it's on the wall here, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and throw it on. So it's all prepped and ready to go. Good old Johnny working hard over there, and uh, it's it's ready to rock and roll. So enjoy the vlog, you guys. All right, so we're just prepping while doing the final preps. Just make sure there's no dust specks or anything like that. And you want to make this thing clean because if it's like when it's black, everything shows up. You can't hide anything. So just make sure everything's nice and clean. And it's going to be like pristine. Uh, the only problem is because uh, it's right at eye level, you can see any little imperfections. So that's why we're just making sure to double check everything. And it's going to be nice and smooth. So I'm going to set you guys down over here whenever Johnny's ready. I'm gonna peel the film and then throw it on. Ready to rock and roll? Ready to rock and roll, bro. Okay. Spray it. So you this want is gonna be straight a, alcohol? Yeah, I got alcohol. No, do you want straight alcohol? No, no, no. no. So this is a two-man job. It's uh, hard to get it like nice and clean if we do it by by a, like a one-person job. This is gonna look really nice, you guys. You have to grab one side. Yep. Hold on. Okay. It's a lot harder than it looks. You lay this down first, Johnny. Yeah. There you go. Line up the antenna. There you go. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. Nice and simple. Two-man job. So, I'm gonna get Johnny to hold the camera here. Johnny, I'm gonna take my step ladder here. Okay, Johnny, so here, 
because we did a pre-cut, I'm just gonna, uh, I did a little extra bigger around the hole so that it covers all the white. Hold the camera. Okay, cross your fingers, hope this works. Because <laughs> we only have one shot, hopefully it works. If it doesn't work, we screwed ourselves over. Yeah. Covered in your side? Mm hmm. Decent, eh? Decent, bro. Decent. Oh. I guess the secret of it is to make sure all these lines are symmetrical, eh? side. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. YouTube. Full throttle. Subscribe. Okay. <laughs> God, I'm I might need your time. I mean, you help. Here, John. You want to pick up that side, please, again? Huh? Attack this side, and we're gonna attack the other side, okay? <laughs> okay, you should do attack the middle here. You mean pull on the other side? Uh, it should be okay. It's so nice, this stuff, eh? This film is uh, really easy to, uh, to stretch. Okay. Okay, one more in the middle and then the thing is about this, the difference between this film and let's say like a vinyl, this actually protects the paint from like chips or like not like a vinyl. A vinyl will just, just get demolished. But this stuff, protection film, and it will withstand a lot of uh, damage. And it will protect your uh, paint underneath uh, for many years to come. And, uh, and it, of course, is black. Okay, that's it, Jay. Anyway, it's gonna start squeegeeing it out. Do you need to take some to your side or no? 
Or are you good? Uh, you can, no, it's fine. You can just get your room to stretch. Okay, and then I'm gonna cut it down the middle. Are you recording? Oh, no. Now I'm gonna go ahead and cut it down the middle here. Absolutely beautiful. And it's a shame. I really wanted to try out that gloss carbon fiber, but way too expensive. And uh, yeah, I tried getting a sponsorship and they pretty much said no. Emotional <laughs> damage. Getting sponsorship is not that easy, you guys. Not that easy. I'm not asking for anything free, but you know, but they said they flat out pretty much said no. That's okay. We'll, we'll try again next time. Maybe the channel just not big enough. Well, I think the channel is not big enough. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, eh? What do you think, Johnny? Looks what do you good. think of the look? Looks good. This changes the look, eh? This is your suggestion anyways. My suggestion always but you're a good right. suggestion. Instead of a stormtrooper, panda look, eh? Japanese theme, eh? Panda? Panda. Yeah, panda. I like that. A lot easier than I, a lot easier to lay this film down than I thought. Turned out really nice, eh, Johnny? Mm-hmm. The nice thing about this is hatchback, you can just open it up. Oh. Nice thing, hey? up and then look at them not me there we go and then we can uh, warm it up and then wrap it in just like that perfect the only problem with this there's a pump protection with a little mm. thick side and being mm. a little thick it doesn't wrap in mm -hmm. easy or just like vinyl it does not act like vinyl around the corners here so if you guys are wondering if it wraps in like vinyl it doesn't you have to treat it as a paint protection film so you might have a little mm. bit of exposure of the white paint or whatever original color or OEM color is if you uh, do this kind of film So if any of you guys have like vinyl experience, you may be able to get this film to lay down a lot easier than I am. It just said, uh, there's limitations, I guess, when it comes to this. You see, it lays down nicely here, but you see how right here, it doesn't lay down. So we'll see, well, I might have to just put a couple seam marks in there and, and uh, go from there. But if you guys, uh, any of you vinyl guys that know how to do it uh, or have you ever worked with this kind of film, uh, leave a comment below. Let us know what the uh, tricks are or if there's any tips that you guys recommend. Let's see if I can put a seam here. Boom, wham. 
Then we get rid of this part here too here. Just, yeah, make it look pretty. Right here. I mean, it's pretty decent, eh, Johnny? I think so. Yeah, let's try and finish up the other side. Nice. Focus. Yeah. Oh boy. So you just take your tool, any kind of tool, slim enough to get underneath the rubber and is run it across and then at the same time get a hard card and then or a towel or a, even a towel and run it across to, to soak up the water or wicker the water out and then the film will just tuck right inside there just like that. Absolutely gorgeous. Now I can drive around and uh, not worry about rock chips and still look Pretty unique now. Well, not unique until somebody else does it, but <laughs> you get the drift. Look at that. Now no more scratches. Roof protected. Yeah. Done. Done. All right, you guys, if you have any questions, feel free. Contact any of your Lumar dealer in your uh, area. Just you go to lumar.com, look for the dealer locator, and uh, one of them should be able to help you out if you guys are interested in this film. But other than that, we'll see you guys. We'll hope you guys like this vlog. And uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And we'll see you guys in next week's vlog. See ya.